First one. Hey, we got a delay, yes! We gotta walk out, this could be it, baby! Uh, it's a regular walkout. Oh, damn it, Italian. Juventus, Chiellini. Inform! Ah, there, there are some informs that are good from this team week that are not going to be walkouts. So, that's okay. Striker. Juventus, the ball, yes! <laughs> that's, dude, that's as good as it can get for, like, a not wa no walkout. That's, that's what you want to see. That's what you want to see! Damn, I want another walkout, bro. But my non-walkouts haven't been bad. Center mid, we're gonna have Turan. Uh, at least he's an 84, it's not great. Ah, oh, but we got three 84s. Ramsey was in there as well, two 83s. Okay. Yes! Back to back, here we go, here we go, walk out, baby! Walk out, baby, go blue! Oh. Is that Bell do? Manchester City, Kevin De Bruyne, baby! Kevin De Bruyne, baby, let's go! Yes, sir! Okay, they're putting out, son! They're putting out! Last one, one more delay. Damn, no delay. Ah, ah, Alexandro, not expensive. Back-to-back -back Alexandros. What's happening, my beautiful people? My name is Dirty Mike, and today, my friends, I'm answering the multi-million coin question. Would you rather have Team of the Year Messi or Team of the Year Ronaldo? And I've played against all three of the Blues, and not even in the draft. I'm talking about the real deal, Holyfield, but I did draft both of them. And I like using this game mode as kind of a tester. I got them both in the squad. I'm going to show you the gameplay. We're going to discuss it. If you enjoy the content, make sure to drop a thumbs up. And in the comments down below, out of the three attackers, Suarez, Messi, Ronaldo, list them in order. One, two, and three. Who would you rather have? We're going to discuss this throughout the video because I've got some opinions. And also, out of the new Blues clues that are coming this week, who are you picking up? Be realistic with yourself. If you're not getting the Ronaldo, you're not getting the Messi, hey, no shame in your game. But who are you picking up? I think it's about that time for us to get started. All this happened in the live stream. You guys are always more than welcome to watch me play full matches live. I like to play against the subscribers, go back and forth. Get the kick back, relax. Uh, my streams have been starting a little bit later, 4 or 5 p.m. my time. So it's only later if you're, of course, in Europe. Uh, but I'm doing my best to make sure that I'm able to put together the content. I actually have AT&T coming uh, this weekend to install their internet package because Comcast has been giving me a lot of trouble. I can't have it. I can't accept that. Comcast, I'm going to the competitor. Yeah. I figure if I have... Both internet providers, even though AT&T has never offered anywhere near the speeds Comcast has in my area, surely one of them's got to work at all times. I'm not happy about my bill, but I'll do whatever I can, I can to make sure that I'm able to create the content and able to live stream when I want to. When I want to produce good material for you guys that are sitting back, relaxing, well, maxing, relaxing, you see, yeah, you see what I'm doing. I want to be able to do that. It's stupid to pay for a top package and then have problems on problems on problems. Uh, and you saw my draft team was stellar. Anytime you have Ronaldo and Messi, you should feel confident. Confident? Just made up a new word. No, but you should go into matches knowing. And look at the speed here. This is unbelievable. Because you guys know I'm not really a boosting down the wing type player uh, in terms of the sprint dribble. But, wow. And I actually noticed in all three players, because I played against... Suarez as well. Uh, one of the subscribers has a bigger bankroll than me, and he had Suarez, Messi, and Ronaldo already. All the blues. And if you saw this in stream, then you know that I'm telling you the truth. And Suarez was fast. He was rapid and still very strong. Good with his body uh, in terms of being able to kind of slow things down, speed it up, a mix of everything. I actually think he's going to be the most, most valuable of the three to pick up. I only say that because Ronaldo and Messi's normal cards are already at this top tier level. And I'm not saying Suarez isn't, but Suarez for me is a top tier cam and he's a great striker, his regular card. However, the new blue and improved, he goes from a top tier cam, as I was saying, and a great striker to now top tier or world class and world class uh, because he feels fast and he still has the ability to shoot from anywhere on the pitch. He can create, he's got the skill moves, both feet, not a problem, watch him work. He's got that Travella. If you've used Suarez this year, the man has one of the best Travella outside of the boot 
Oh, he can create. And he scored a lot of big long shots for me when I've used him in FIFA 17. Uh, especially in those park the bus matches and I don't like those but they're gonna happen especially if you're playing in the weekend league you can count on the park the bus you can count on the custom formations do I co-sign it do I enjoy it absolutely not no I do not uh, but we're actually playing a three at the back too which took me a little while to get used to when playing the draft uh, or just in general playing any anytime you're playing three at the back I feel as if there is gonna be a learning curve uh, is this gonna work is it not gonna work but let's talk about Messi and Ronaldo here. Messi, what do you get? Now, I noticed this card stronger. Still going to be lightning fast. He still has the same type of shooting capabilities, uh, but he is stronger, uh, which is worth noting because that's one of his weaknesses. And he jumps well. This man is great in the air. Uh, I, I know that you're not trying to whip in crosses to Messi, but he is a more gifted version of himself. And he's still going to have that heavenly left foot. So you can shoot from anywhere doesn't really matter whether it's outside inside finesse shot power driven pick your poison and then Ronaldo I don't know if I've played with a faster player I'm not sure uh, and he has all the other Ronaldo qualities uh, so I didn't feel major jumps in terms of shooting and finishing and I don't know if you will because Ronaldo already tops everyone in these areas when you're looking at statistics and characteristics and what someone's capable of Ronaldo is on his own playing field for the most part. However, I do want to say that I did notice his speed has gone up, which is crazy when you think about how fast he is. I mean, I'm not the type of guy that just does knock-ons or just sprints, and I literally, pew, 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 and keeping that on repeat, which is crazy for me as a player, even having that as an option. But I, once I got to my full speed, I, nobody's catching me. And the reason that Ronaldo still got to be better than Messi, well, I guess it depends a little bit how you play. But as a striker, Ronaldo has to be better than Messi, hands down, just off the size. When you guys have two players that are equal speed, but one of them's got five star skills and he's six one versus five seven, you got to go with the six one guy almost every day of the week. It just it makes more sense. It's logical, and you see it in game where you have to go for those battles or, and you have some shielding circumstances. But as a cam, there's something Messi does as a center attacking mid that if you've got the, the, the striking personnel, finishers, guys with a little bit of size, he's just so sneaky on the ball. And as long as the connection is good, it's not an issue. We actually discussed this during my live stream and, and Discord as well, where Messi is a gameplay player. If that makes sense so if the gameplay is good Messi is good however if the gameplay is bad you might have issues or you might find uh, some problems with Messi thank God we beat this guy in the, uh, the the last match he was starting to hold the ball in the ninth minute I made one mistake uh, and I was sitting there like if I lose the Ronaldo and Messi people are gonna roast me twitch people are gonna roast me but we got Pogba wiggling and working awesome draft in terms of the quality of the player is not great cam it is what it is so I'm still going with Ronaldo and Suarez is really the question for me Suarez to me makes the most sense in terms of the coin investment what do you guys think down below but I have a lot more content coming for you ASAP ASAP I didn't get anything special in those packs you guys did see that I had packs at the beginning of the video though so thumbs up for that we did some 100k joints as I said I would people got got on me on the video previously where they said Mike there's not that many packs being opened. This video is short, et cetera, et cetera. I said, look, I'm going to open more tonight. I just want the big promo packs. That's what I want. I want to give you guys the 100Ks, the 125Ks. And I had to wait for those to come out, for those to be released. But until next time, my friends, 